Wien so lang staan skoene hoofstuk 31, die corner sonder entertainment. When Lynn's alarm woke her up that morning, she knew exactly what she had to do. After break, she cornered Hein on the corridor. She tells him that she wants to talk business. Hein looks extremely uncomfortable and Lynn ask, asks him to rather meet her at the wimpy after school so that they can talk. That whole day, she keeps thinking about Dibby, Dibby with no legs, and also about Sprout. When she exits Afrikaans class, Jeffra Breitenbach asks about her neck, the neck that is keeping her out of school. She says it is better, but will still take a while to heal. Jeffra Breitenbach tells her it is not too late to work for a distinction in Afrikaans. Now we see the font is different, meaning Brahm is watching a video. He sees kids on a stage and it looks like a prize giving, e prize -giving evening. The camera zooms in on a girl with dark hair. She is handed a trophy and everyone claps their hands. Remember, he can only see this, he cannot hear this. Brad pretends to clap his hands as well and he laughs at himself. At the Wimpy, Lean tells Hein about her colleague that lost his legs. She tells him that he needs a wheelchair, however, not a normal wheelchair. Hein asks, what they do for work. Lean ignores this question. Lean comments that Hein is more good with building things with his hands and that she will pay. Since Debbie's accident, Lean has been very zenuwachtig, nervous about the cars all around her, about Sprut as well, and just in general when people stare at her too long. Sprut doesn't come around um, often anymore. And if he does, he drives in the middle lane as not to interact with Lin. It is only Lin and the Ruiz under the tree at break time. Ru Ruiz didn't say where she was when the accident happened, because remember, she was gone. But she knew exactly what went down. Ruiz is very protective of, over Tibby's corner. Johnny tried his luck, saying it is only until Tibby gets back. Ruiz marched up to Johnny and before she, could get, before she could get to him, he ran away. Remember the last time she hit him. It is now very quiet on the corner. Too quiet. The corner without entertainment. And this is where the Wifstuk title comes in. Lean tells Ruiz about her plan to get Tibby wheels and that Hein might be able to make it. Ruiz asks, who is going to pay for this? Lean suggests that they ask everyone that begs there and everyone who knows Tibby to chip in. Ruiz is very skeptical that they will get others to contribute. Okay, guys, this was Wistik 31. I hope that this helped you. Goodbye.